Hey everybody, it's Matt from the house and I have got this box from Soltech. We got some shoes sent over. We're gonna test them out in some of our fresh out of the box videos. Now let's open this thing up and see what's inside. Fresh. All right, so if you haven't seen any of our fresh out of the box videos, definitely check them out. Basically, we take a pair of shoes, we take them right out of the box, put them on and skate them right away just to see how they feel brand new, fresh out of the box. Then I wear them around for a week, kind of break them in a little bit and skate them again just to kind of get a little feel of how they feel day one versus how they feel after they've broken in a little bit. But we've got a few shoes in here from Etnies and America. And these are gonna be in some of our upcoming fresh out of the box videos. And let's see what they sent over. All right, looks like we got some Wino G6 slip-ons. We got some Temples. We got some Tilt G6 toy machine collab. Oh, excited about that one. Uh, we got some Wino standards, a classic shoe. And we got some Marana slips. So it looks like we get we got a little bit more America than Etnies, which is fine because we did a lot of Etnies ones in the past. Some of these new America shoes. I haven't actually seen some of these in person yet. So right off the bat, these Etnies Marana slips. These are pretty rad. You got kind of like a green color on that thing with the black sole. Usually you go with the white sole, that white vulcanized sole. So definitely like the look of that. I'm not a big slip guy myself, but we're gonna test them out. This is the best way to, to obviously experience these shoes for the first time and kind of step outside the comfort zone. So pretty excited about those. Next up, we got some Wino Standard. So this is a pretty cool shoe. This shoe actually started out as just a chiller shoe, a shoe that you would never ever skate. It was almost like, Hey, instead of wearing flip-flops or sandals, you can wear something that looks like a skate shoe. And then it actually turned into a skate shoe. They put a more substantial sole on it. Pretty cool look on that one. Just a nice, easy, standard shoe. No bells and whistles. Then, what's this one? The Temple. This one's a pretty cool shoe. I've been seeing this one. I actually haven't seen it in person. I always thought this was a cup sole because I hadn't seen them in person, but it actually is a Volk. It looks like it's got kind of a little beefier Volk sole to it. I do like the shape on the toe of that one. It's got kind of a little bit wider shape. On the front of the shoe, I was never a big fan of the super, super pointy shoes. But nice, clean looking shoe. Kind of looks like an old school like tennis shoe and not just like general tennis shoes, but shoes for playing tennis and kind of like court style. So excited about those. Then we've got the Tilt. This one's a pretty cool shoe. It's kind of got, America's usually got those little bit cleaner lines on them. Not a lot going on. This one's got a little bit extra going on on the side, which I do like. I'm always a big fan of a little bit more techy shoes. Uh, but these are a G6, so they've got that super cushy G6 insole in them, even though they are a Volk sole. So big, big fan of that. And uh, Toy Machine collaboration. Pretty cool on that one. They got a little Toy Machine hit on the tongue and underneath as well. But uh, yeah, I can't wait to check those out. Then we've got the Wino G6 slip-on. So this essentially came from the Wino, but it's a slip-on version. Ooh, this is pretty dope. This is that Skate Shop Day color with the uh, brick sole in the black upper. So like I was saying, this is basically, you take the Wino and are actually kind of souping it up a little bit and doing a slip-on version of it. So we've got a little heel pocket on there and then they're doing the G6. So it means it's got that nice big thick G6 sole in it. A little bit more cushioning and a little bit more uh, kind of oomph, I would say, in a skate shoe. All right, I'm pretty excited to get out and test these things out. It's gonna take a few weeks, obviously. It's gonna take one, two, three, four, five weeks to get all of these done, but we'll definitely get out, skate them, and give you some feedback as soon as possible. We'll have some fresh out of the box videos coming at you. But if you've got any questions about any of this stuff or any of the other shoes that we have at thehouse.com, definitely leave some comments down below. Also make sure to like, subscribe, don't forget that notification bell on too so you can find out when all the new videos drop, especially those fresh out the box videos. And yeah, grab yourself a pair of shoes and get out and skate. Fresh.